what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of fps dropping frame dropping or stuttering issue you're currently having with rainbow six siege so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial in the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issues before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know or let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work you youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so uh the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is going to be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen we're going to right click your, your taskbar and open up your task manager or just simply use the shortcut for that the next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen clicking onto processes and once you click processes i want you to click onto cpu and end every single task which is currently having too much cpu or gpu usage at the moment so let me explain that too many applications too many programs too many games whatever running at the same time with too much cpu or gpu usage will cause fps drops stutterings or frame drops on the long term and you're avoiding this issue by just simply ending those tasks once you're finished with that you should be um able to end the task manager again Navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen where you're going to click onto the window symbol, open up your settings and navigate right into gaming where you're going to stick around the Xbox game bar. Well, obviously want you to turn this off because the Xbox game bar doesn't really come with any benefit besides impacting your performance really bad. You don't want it. So just simply turn this off. Afterwards, click into captures and stick around background recording. Where I want you to go to record in the background while I'm playing a game and obviously turn this off because the, I mean, it's obvious if you're recording a game, it will impact your performance really bad especially in low end or bad pcs but either way guys you don't want to record something with windows so just simply turn this off either way and come back once in a while to check if this is really turned off afterwards i want you to click into game mode and once you're at that game mode i you i can't really tell you not to turn this off or on you need to check it for yourself because the system specifically just stick with the setting which is working better go back once and hit update in security stick around windows update and i can i know it's, it's gonna sound a little bit basic guys but it will help you a lot so trust me and download the latest version of windows and once you're finished with that simply end this task and do the same thing for a graphics card so hit the application hit the browser download the latest version of your drivers uh, of your graphics card driver and provide the best possible performance in general for your pc that's it for the video guys i hope that i could actually help you out of this one if it was like that just leave a like a comment or a subscription i'm gonna really be thankful for that i guess i'm really sorry if i couldn't help you but i'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out either way i hope you guys have a wonderful day see you at the next one and bye